It's simple. We need them, they need us. Fargo has a vibrant economy. A lot of us are immigrants. Our great-grandparents have come over to this land of opportunity. Oftentimes it's family that's here that wants their family to come here. And how can any of us imagine being in a refugee camp for five years waiting to come to the United States? Why wouldn't I want to bring them into my community? Our team, we assure uh, the opportunity for new arrivals. If they have U.S. ties, U.S. families and friends, that we're making those proper connections, or if they're a free case, uh, just arriving on their own, that we prepare for them and that we secure their housing. Most importantly, are at the airport to welcome them, to make them feel like they're home, that they're safe, and that they're welcome here. When, the, when I welcomed them in the airport, the first thing I say, jump, I say hi to them. Oh, they were so happy. They like hugged me like this. <laughs> they said, oh, it's so nice to, to, to start in the airport with someone that, the language that you know. And they was very happy. Like I say, it's good to see that you're helping and then the person, like, you see that is getting help from you, you know, especially when they're new, they just know you as a case manager. Anytime they need something, they call you. You feel like you, you're giving them more attention. Before they arrive, we've found them housing and we've provided them with the basic necessities of furniture, bedding, appropriate foods for their refrigerator and cupboards so that they indeed do feel as though they're home once they arrive. I love actually helping people. I started doing this type of social work, uh, helping people. When I was back in my village at a very young age, there are so many things that we have to set up, like talk to the U.S. Thai, find an apartment, or the U.S. Thai finds an apartment. There are shopping things, planning to schedule, what type of program do they fit in. We enroll the children in schools. We make sure that the adults get signed up for Adult Learning Center, English as a Second Language courses, or any other services like that that are going to be needed. Every step of the way is meant to take them on a path to self-sufficiency. And now I'm trying to give back like what I have learned, what I, I, what I got, how I was helped. I still do like multiple jobs and errands. With this team by my side, we're going to accomplish great things for the city of Fargo and North Dakota. We have so many more positive upgrades and you as an immigrant or a refugee can make that happened.